With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. This our question is, find the ratio in which the point P 11, Y divides the line segment joining the points A 15,5 and B 9,20. Also find the value of Y. Okay, so for this, in this question, they are given us that we have to find the ratio. Okay ratio in which there is a point P okay point P divides the line segment AB okay so we can say that let us suppose we have a line segment this is a line segment this is line segment which is let us suppose this is AB is the line segment okay and here this is P point okay so let us suppose this is P point divides this line segment okay in the ratio in any ratio and we have to find this ratio okay so let us suppose the ratio is becomes this Point P divides the line segment in the ratio M is to N. M and okay. Now we have to find the ratio as well as we have to find the value of Y. Okay. So for this they are given as the coordinates of point P is 11 comma Y. Okay. And they are given as the coordinates of A is 15 comma 5. Okay friend. And B is 9 comma 20. Okay friend. So for this now what you will do that we have a they are we have a formula for finding the ratio okay so for this we have a ratio formula for this which is equal to for x and y coordinates so for this we can say that so let us suppose this we can su suppose this is this is our x1 comma y1 okay this is our point p let us suppose this is x comma y coordinates and this is x2 comma y2 okay now we have a formula which is x is equal to m x2 plus n x1 divided by m plus n this is for finding the value of p x coordinate of this mid of this point and we have similarly y is equal to this is m y2 plus n y1 divided by m plus n okay friend so now we have they have another x coordinate is equal to 11 so we can write it here this for this we will use the x or x formula to find the value of m n okay to find the value of m n so for this we can say that we have this is x is equal to 11 so we can say that this is 11 equal to we see we have m x2 x2 is x1 this is x2 so x2 is 9 m into 9 plus n n into x1 x1 is 15 okay divided by we have m plus n okay so we can say that by cross multiply this is added as this is 11 m plus 11 n which is equal to 9m plus 15n okay so by shifting we can say that 9m goes there so this is 11m minus 9m which is 2m so this is 2m this is equal to 11n shifted so this is 15n minus 11n which is 4n so by we can cross multiply so this is m by n which is equal to this is 4 by 2 so we can say that this is equal to 2 by 1 okay so we can say that our m ratio n which is equal to 2 ratio 1 okay so this is the first answer now we have to find the value of y also so we can say that ratio is 2 is to 1 okay so now anyway, now we will use this formula to use to find the value of y so for this we have we have to find the value of y so y is equal to so y is equal to m y 2 m now we have to find the value of y so we m is here 2 so this is 2 into y 2 is becomes 20 here 20 so we can say this is 20 now we have n n is no we know that this is 1 1 into y1 is 5 okay divided by m plus n m plus n is 2 plus 1 is 3 okay this is 3 y which is equal to this is 40 40 plus 5 okay now we can say that this is y is equal to this is 45 divided by 3 so this is equal to 15 so we can say that y is equal to 15 and ratio is becomes ratio is become 2 is to 1 and these two are the correct answer for this question thank you for watching for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today